Hey, hi friends. Welcome back everyone to my channel. This is Prince once again here. So friends, this video is going to be very, very interesting because we are going to do postmortem of our doctor strategy. You would have seen doctors doing postmortem, but now we are doing postmortem of the doctor. Okay. So jokes apart, friends, this video is going to be very, very interesting. The reason because we are going to find, dissect and find out the reason why many of them were successfully able to follow the doctor strategy and why is that many of them quit trading the doctor strategy. Now, why is it I'm back of this doctor strategy from a long time? If you have seen me, I already shared the strategy from a long time. I've been promoting many of them to trade this. I've been asking many of them to cultivate discipline using the strategy. Also, I gave an improvised uh, uh, strategy of uh, doctor strategy itself. I gave an improvising method as well. Now, I'm talking about uh, the postmortem of this. Why am I giving so much of importance for all these things? Friends, let me tell you very, very clearly. If at all you are not able to master your discipline, if at all you are not able to master your psychology, if you are not going to get control of this particular issue which you are having, then there is no point in me giving you any number of strategies. There is no point in me explaining to you the best of the best strategies. If you are not able to get in control of your psychology and your discipline, then all the strategies are going to be waste. There is, it will be an utter waste of me keeping uploading the strategy. That is why I want to make sure that you get your discipline correct. I need to make sure that you get your psychology correct. That is why I'm giving you so much of importance. That's why I'm making you go through so much of uh, content, making you realize that what the real reason behind people getting money in stock market. Okay, so let me do the postmortem of this particular strategy. As you all know that I shared, I shared the strategy almost two months month and I very clearly told that this is a strategy which I use as a medicine for people those who are having difficulty with following a strategy with discipline and also having issues with their psychology. Okay, so this strategy is dedicated for those kinds of people, right? And also in case if you're not uh, started that strategy or if you're not doing a strategy, you can just check my channel or also or also I'll put in the description of this video. You can just check, you'll get the strategy. It's a very simple strategy in Bank Nifty options. Okay, so uh, the main reason many of them stopped trading this strategy was the continuous losses. Obviously, it is going to happen. I'll just show you. So this is the back tested data. This is not the live data. Live data somehow I could not compile because I'm not doing the strategy. It was given to only my students and my mentees and all of you who are following me on my YouTube. So it started off well. It went on decently. There was a three days loss, normal plus or minus going on, going on, going on. But here you can see around 7th November, the losses has, uh, there was continuous one, two, three, four, five, five losses. So already by this third loss, many of them lost patience. They started uh, doubting the strategy, thinking that the strategy is no longer working. And initially when I shared the strategy, many of them were sending me the Excel files. They were telling me that, yes, I'm going to follow with a lot of discipline and all those things. But then later when I saw this particular phase, I found that many of them started, I mean, many of them stopped trading and they were quitting the strategy, thinking that the strategy is not working or something is going wrong and all those things. Okay, so this was one among the major reason which I felt that many of them stopped trading the strategy. Second thing is the inbound low ROI. That is nothing but the returns of investment. I had very clearly told you this strategy is not for returns. This is for making sure that you cultivate discipline in your trading. Because once you master discipline and once you master your psychology, then sky is the limit you can uh, take any strategy and you can make good profit so in order to come to that level i told you start with this because the losses are going to be very small and then you will get the get the courage to keep on trading okay i had told you but many of them thinking that the returns are very low they quit and one more third reason which i heard many of them quitting when i asked many of them is that they told the brokerages are very high because you're going to take multiple entries uh, against straddle needs uh, call and a put also to sell so again, the brokerages are very high. So there's no point paying so much of brokerage for less profit and all those things. So for them, I just have to say only one thing, friend. First, come into profit. Then think about brokerage. If you go behind all these brokerages, expenses and all those things, if you look into that, you're not going to... It is like how, you know, you go to your college and say that I don't want to pay the fees. I don't want to pay the monthly fees or examination fees. Uh, I'll just directly go write the exam. I want something where there is no broker. I mean, there is no exam fees and all those things. But if at all you need your degree, you need to spend money for that. In the same way, in order to get discipline, in order to get a successful strategy, in order to get the mindset, first try to follow a strategy which, which you know, 
uh, which gives you the strength to continue even in uh, continuous loss phases even if there is losses the drawdowns are going to be very small so it will help you in continuing the strategy so don't go to think about brokerages and etc etc it is uh, as of now bullshit is just think that it is only an expense which you are paying for your studies or for your degree okay now these were the major things there are many reasons many of them told i just tried to ask few of them but then the most interesting part is that i asked few people who are still continuing the strategy i called them specifically and asked them what made you continue doing the strategy and how was that you were able to continue doing trading the first thing which i could summarize from them was that they had conviction with the strategy so how they got this conviction is because they did the back test thoroughly also they did manual testing of the strategy and also they tried doing paper trading and then doing the real trade so they were they had very good conviction in the strategy this is one thing which is very very important friends if you don't do your back testing you will not get confidence in the strategy and you will quit when you get this kind of continuous 3 days 4 days 5 days losses second uh, most important thing which i got feedback from the people was that they had no expectations that is they had no uh, expectation of having uh, 50% returns 100% returns this kind of expectations were not there in your mind and all these people were working with uh, when they were in good positions they were working with good companies they had good salaries or might be they had good business or something of that sort they did not have any expectation from this market and they did not have any expectation from this uh, strategy i by expectation i mean the monthly uh, the money expectation they did not want 50% 100% returns they had no expectation they were ready to take whatever market gives them so that is one more reason third thing was position sizing this i felt was really beautiful a uh, few of them i observed what they did was even though they had big capital even though they had 5 lakh or 10 lakh or whatever is that they only traded with one lot so even when they got this continuous 4 days 5 days losses it was not even pinching them because the overall loss was just a small percent of their capital overall capital so due to this what happened that they were able to continue doing the strategy even in phases of continuous losses continuous uh, even they saw 4 5 days continuous losses they did not bother them so i felt that these three were the most important thing there are many other things okay so people those who feel there are many other things that they were uh, they could continue the strategy i recommend you to please put in the comment section it will also help others also to uh, find out the reason of continuing a strategy sticking to a strategy okay so please put in your comment section so uh, to just to give you an update uh, uh, the performance is uh, october i shared it in uh, before october and the performance is was like this Uh, October had seven thousand returns. So this is after zero point five percent of uh, slippages, which are considered. The returns might vary because many are doing it manually. November, as you can see, was almost a break-even month, and December, as of now, is doing very good. And we have still half the month to go, more than half the month to go. So, as I told you, don't look into ROI. Even if you are in break-even, even if you are in positive, that is more than enough. if you are able to stick to the strategy for a long long time automatically it will take care of your profits it will make sure that you get yearly 40 50% returns easily and the best part is the uh, statistics i'll just show you the statistics the maximum loss a continuous loss was 5 days which i showed you so 5 days is something which you can bear and the maximum loss also maximum drawdown was also only 9753 that's the beauty friends so with a capital of around uh, 3 lakhs just losing 9753 maximum drawdown it will not pinch anyone it will not hurt anyone that is a beauty that is why i am saying you to use the strategy okay it will really help on your psychology it will really work on your psychology okay friends hope this video was really helpful for you i tried to dissect and find out the reason why many of them were not able to trade the strategy and also i was trying to find out why many of them are continuing doing the strategy hope this will help you also to understand the real secrets behind trading a strategy for a long time hope this video was really helpful to you and please please don't forget to press the like button in case if you really like the video and also don't forget to press the subscribe button and if at all you press the like and the subscribe button it really motivate me to come out with more and more nice strategies and more and more regular educational content as well thank you and have a nice day